Okay, here we've got Umihara Kuwais Bazooka on Nintendo Switch. Um, this review code was provided to me by NN Games. Thank you guys very much for the review opportunity. I'll take a look here. So this game um, is based on the, uh, it's part of the uh, uh, Umihara Kuwais series. Uh, this is a little bit different. This one has you uh, playing as um, plays one of, these, one of these characters here, and the point of the game it's it's kind of a mix between uh, Umihara Kuwais and Bubble uh, Bubble Bobble in the sense that you ha still have the hook shot from uh, from uh, Umihara, the the hook uh, weapon, but the point of the game is to clear the lo clear the waves of enemies um, going from level to level. So we've got challenge mode. Clear stages one after another, defeat enemies and collect coins. Battle mode, a battle mode for up to four players. Play either locally or online. Leaderboards and options. So we have options here. So we've got background, music, sound effects, voices, and language settings, button settings, and credits. And then so we go ahead and enter challenge mode. So you got single player, friend mode, ravel mode, and how to play. Single player, single player challenge mode, clear, uh, clear stages one after another, and aim for the goal for one player only. Friend mode, cooperate with friends and aim for the goal for two to four players. Rival mode, mode where you can also attack your friends for two to four players and how to play. And going into battle mode, you've got local play, local play mode for two to four players, online play, challenge other players online for one player only, and how to play. Now, uh, as of this review, the game is available in uh, the uh, uh, in the EU or Europe eShop. It's not yet available in on the uh, in the North American eShop, um, and there uh, there is a physical release um, available for purchase through uh, the uh, Strictly Limited Games um, website. So their their store page. So if you guys want a physical release of this game, it is available through Strictly Limited Games. Uh, again, thank you in Games for this review opportunity. Uh, this game is actually a lot of fun. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at challenge mode, and then um, after that, we'll take a look at how the two-player or uh, uh, multiplayer uh, uh, goes here. So we're gonna go ahead and do single player. Okay, so we got a lot of different characters to choose from. So we've got uh, Kawais, we've got Sylvie, uh, Jin, Queen, Cotton from uh, from the Cotton games, which is kind of cool. Let's see. Uh, we got uh, uh, Apley from Cotton, uh, Amiko from uh, Sayonara, uh, Umi Hire Kawais. We've got uh, Noko, uh, Noko also from uh, Umi Hire Kawais. Uh, Luffy from Doki Doki uh, Piochio. Got Marin. We've got Pai, I think is how you say her name. We've got uh, Doichi. Uh, and this kid, I believe, it's, yeah, this kid's from this game. Uh, we've got Tenko. We've got Nana. Lucina from. Um, uh, she's from Night Stalker, so it's kind of cool to see to see her here too. Uh, Su Suzuna, I think is how you say it. Um, and then you've got Dazzle. I guess as a YouTuber, I actually don't know. <laughs> I don't know who he is, but apparently he's he's famous if he's in this game, right? <laughs> All right, we've got uh, Ariel, uh, Sonic Cat from Ring Dream, uh, Pachi, Pochi. Uh, Izuki, uh, the Ani Slayer, and then Random. So we're going to go ahead and do uh, uh, Kawais. That's just who I prefer playing with. And once you pick character, you can choose the color. I'm going to go ahead and go with uh, the standard standard default palette. So we've got Beginner, Semi-Auto Technical, Beginner, Automatic Lure Controls, designed for players unfamiliar with Omahara Kawais. Semi-auto, automatically reel in the lure when attached to a surface. Or technical, manual control type, lure handles the same as in the Umihari Kuwait series. 
Um, for the sake of this review, I'm going to go ahead and do semi-auto. Okay, so it's broken up into four worlds. Um, there are nine levels uh, per world and then a boss stage. And it looks like my game didn't transfer over, but that's okay. We're going to start from the beginning. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, so you've got... Come on, here we go. Okay, I'm going to... Look at that. <laughs> okay, so the point of the game is to... Whoop. Is clear levels by hitting each of the enemies with the bazooka. And I thought there was another... There's supposed to be another enemy here. I don't know why it's not here. There it is. Okay, no, no it's not. Okay. I do it? Come on. Oh, I have to kill that one. Okay. What in the world? Because you can't pick these ones up. Oh, no, you can. Really? I don't know if that was a glitch or not. That was weird. Because normally it's just supposed to spawn. So yeah, you can you can use the uh, A button to throw out hamburgers to make, to heal you, and I should probably do that because whoa. Okay, so I need to fire that guy out of the bazooka. I need to actually do that. Try that again. Yeah, so the game actually isn't letting me do what I need to do. Oh no, yes it is. I was just hitting the wrong button. Wow. <sighs> Jeez. And... I didn't do it in time. <laughs> That's okay. Um, so when you... Uh, when you get those enemies, you gotta hit the R button to... To fire them out of your bazooka. And I was just being silly and not doing that. So your goal with each uh, level is to get four coins. You get four coins and um, you move on. the next level and you get coins by killing enemies okay got two coins actually this might work Okay, one more. And... There we go. 
One more coin is what I need. Oh, there we go. Next stage, stage two. Oh, uh, that was that was silly. With this stage, I like, so I like uh, being under here because of these little guys. So like I was saying, yeah, with the little A with the A button you can uh, bring your HP back up by use it by throwing yourself out hamburgers. Oh, and then you have the L button that does a, a super attack. Y is your hook, your lure. B is your regular shot. Okay, that works. I must say, the chain reactions are pretty satisfying. <laughs> so we can get them all. Awesome. That was cool. Okay, now I'm gonna just go ahead and wait here. Come on. There we go. Obviously, the bigger chain reactions you get, you you're almost guaranteed to get a coin. Stage three. So uh, every three stages, they are going to to introduce a new character, a new enemy type. That's what I meant to say. And with these ones, these ones are kind of tricky. Because you got to jump on them and then double jump in order to kill them. But you can use the spring, so it's nice. I'm going to use this turret over here to kill these two snakes. So for those that are not familiar with the Hamikoi series, whoops, uh, it's a game series that started out on the Super Nintendo or Super Famicom, and then uh, made its way to the PSP. Oops. Um. Really? Oh, that was kind of annoying. What? Okay. There we go. But anyway, yeah, let's start out on the Super Famicom. And then went on the PSP, and I think it was a Vita release, a PS4 release, I believe, and then I believe it was this one. Uh, this has been the latest release. And, um, and the series is actually a lot of fun. Um, I'm glad that, that this 
this is coming to the, to the NEA shop, and this is uh, a, a really awesome Switch release. Uh, very enjoyable, a lot of fun. And also, I think I like this game more than I like the original. Oops. That's not what I wanted. Let's try that again. There we go, got him. There we go, got all of them. Myself some burgers. One more coin to get. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do. This I can kill with the with that. There we go. And coin number five. On to stage five. Oh, there's a coin. Grab that. This game definitely is one of those games that's it's pretty, uh, <laughs> pretty addicting to play. Well, that was close. Okay, we'll go for one more round. Oops. Whoa. So, two more coins. Really? That's not what I expected to have happen. I got that coin now. There we go. Really? Okay. Like, you need to... Give me some burgers here. I do like that you can heal yourself. Oh, I was trying to do that gracefully and that didn't work out well at all. At all. How about I get the last coin? Sweet. Stage six. Cool. Oh, that's a big guy. Got him. All right, so let's look at uh, Umihara Kuwait's uh, single player. We're going to go ahead and now take a look at the multiplayer. So here we go. Okay, so we're going to take a look at the uh, multiplayer. I'm going to be Kuwait, and I'm going to go ahead and do some my auto. And we're playing challenge mode, friend mode. Oh, I hit A. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go ahead and 
go from level four. Now it's been played with up to four players. So it's the same game as the uh, single player, oops, but obviously <laughs> with more than one player. Oops, the wrong button. There you go. Mess up some cheeseburgers. Now the interesting thing I noticed is if you were to say, if I was to say throw a cheeseburger out here, and the second player was to try to grab said cheeseburger. What? Okay, never mind. So when, oops. When I did it earlier, for some reason, my HP went down when I grabbed the second player's um, uh, HP uh, Item, uh, HP boosting item. I'm not sure why. Ah, what the? Oh. So I'm not sure what's, what happened there. But yeah, so this is multiplayer mode, so it's pretty much the same as single player. Um, there are other modes you can do. There's rebel mode where you can uh, gather stars and steal stars from each other. And I'm completely, I'm completely dead. Cool. Oh, uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> I was dead. Go figure. Next stage. <laughs> Oops. Trying to get up there, you go. Really? <laughs> Uh, that was, that was really dumb. That was really, really dumb. Let's try that again. There we go. Oops, we need to get one of those frogs. There we go. Oops. <laughs> Did not mean to do that. One more coin. Okay. What the?
And it looks like... Okay, so... You're dead until the stage ends. Okay. Oops. Well, that was silly. What is that? Oh! That's what that is. That's awesome. <laughs> there we go. Next stage. Oh, we got chicken looking things to fight now. Whoops. Oh, come on, really? I'm gonna grab that coin. And sometimes, oh, okay. Oh, that was cool. Oh, come on. <laughs> Whoa, that was cool. Well, I died, but it was still kind of cool. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Oh, come on. I was going to the line. Seriously? Oh, that was lame. There we go. We may just get to the boss after all. Or not, I could just kill the lot of the frogs. That'll work. Really? I was half kidding with that, and I just going to die. Oh, please tell me you don't have to start that over again. Oh, nope. Okay. Alright, so... Cool. Okay, so I believe there's like one or two more stages in the boss battle. Oh, crap. Okay, oh, that works. Alright, oh. <laughs> that, was, that was pretty easy. <laughs> oh, that one of those things. Oh, man. I hate that thing. Why are there no coins appearing, though? Oh, okay. Oh, a bouncing sheep. 
All right. What the? Cool, I got stuck. That was awesome. Not really, actually. <laughs> oh. Well, I almost made it. Okay, so... Oh, game over. Well, we tried. Oh. That was cool, though. Okay, let's take a look at the other... Um, the other modes. Go ahead and go back. Alright, we're going to go ahead and check out a couple other modes here. We're going to go ahead and do rival mode. See what that's all about. Okay. Okay. Oh, so you do damage to each other, I guess. But how do you... How do you steal the stars, though? Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay, so apparently... It's just... The, so the stars act as lives. Okay. So it's just like a, like a fighting game while you're fighting uh, enemies. Okay. So it's kind of... That's kind of an interesting take. <laughs> oh, man. Really? That was... That was lame. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's uh, that's a pretty interesting gameplay right there. That's kind of funny. Oh come on, really? I just died again. Oh, I got one life left. Oh, that was dumb. That was not what I wanted to do. Okay. This is a very interesting take on the way this game plays, that's for sure. What 
<laughs> oh man. And I'm done. Okay. So yeah, so you kill each other. So it's pretty much the normal game, but there's uh, uh, friendly fire. So that's kind of cool. Okay. Interesting. I may totally completely <laughs> lost, but that's okay. It's much easier way for those little acorn things to be on the ground before you hit them. Now, what if I come back? Okay, I come back with 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 one life. Okay. Really? <laughs> I can only imagine how crazy this would be with four people. Just, <laughs> just two getting out like this. <laughs> oh, this is, this is so cool. Such a good game. Oops. Come on. Oh, that was cool. Okay. Alrighty. Well, I'm going to review. I'm going to end the review here. Um, I want to thank uh, Indian Games for uh, the review opportunity. This game is so awesome. Um, and uh, you can pick it up yourself if you want to pick it up from the eShop. Um, if you have an EU account, uh, you can make yourself an account if you don't already have one. Um, or you can wait until it comes out to the. Um, uh, North American or a USC shop. But uh, either way, this game is a lot of fun. Uh, definitely worth checking out. Um, and like I said, there will be a physical version of the game um, available through the, stick through the uh, Strictly Limited uh, Games website uh, through the store. So be look up, do be on the lookout for that as well um, in the near future. And uh, I want to thank you again for watching or thank you for subscribing. As always, until next time, <laughs> take care and happy gaming.